man. I watched um Erickson Lubin. I watched Erickson Lubin versus um Terrell Gosh, Gosh or whatever the nigga name is. I know you gotta fight the fight, man. And everybody got a chance. But I don't see Erickson Lubin going 12 rounds with Charlo. It's not the boxing that makes the Charlos great. Let me repeat that. I said that before. It's not the boxing that makes them great. It's every... It's, it's fighters. You got to find out what you're great at. You got to find out what you're great at in boxing. And the Charlos are the ones boxers that found out what they was what they was great at. Not good, but great. And they, they fast. They very explosive. They are very, very explosive. And only person I see, only person I see beating them, I can see it, but there's no guarantee that he will beat them. It's only two people. I get no. It's only three people I give a chance of beating them. But I would, I wouldn't really bet against them. But it's three people. Um, Billy Ho. He might have a chance. He is a superb boxer. He's big, he's strong, and he's a superb boxer. He got power, but he also but but he's a good he's a good fucking boxer. The next person is Canelo Alvarez. He has a good chance of beating the Charlos. This was one more. It was one more. Damn, I can't, I can't, I can't call it. But I might pick it up as the video go on. Oh man, um, who was, who was? I can't think of. I said, um, they, it's, 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 it's Jamel. Jamel might not. Jamel. Eric's, Eric's and Lubin style is, is, is like, as long as Jamel Charlo's at 54, I believe Eric's and Lubin should move the fuck down. I believe he should move the fuck down. Is it possible for him to lose those pounds? That's a, if he can lose, lose that weight, he got a better chance of, he got a better chance of fighting Earl Spence and them and getting the title at 147. Then once the Charlo move up, then go back up, then go up to 40, um, then go up to um, 54. But as you can't beat the Charlo, man. It's, Charlo is... Oh, yeah, the other, the, uh, the third person that have a chance of beating them is Demetrius Andre. But there's no guarantee they can beat can beat them. Those it, quick feet, quick feet, a good jab. Even if you stop the jab, it's like the old guys know how to punch. They got punching power. They got speed. They got power, and they got timing. They got speed. They got power and timing. I don't see. Erickson Lee will not be able to beat him. I, I will, I will bet dollars to donuts. I will bet dollars to donuts that Jamel Charlo knock his ass out again. And I fuck, and I would, I would like to see Lee win a world title because he's so hungry, he's so disciplined, and he the type of boxer that that's good for boxing because once he. I believe he can go mainstream. He, he he's a hard worker. He can talk shit. But I, I want him to move down to one forty seven. If he can, if if he can move down to one forty seven, I think he should. 
because as long as a Charlo up there, Charlos is tough, man. People, a lot of people, I know a lot of people don't like them because of their attitudes and shit. Those guys are. Those guys got some wild ways and shit. They they rub people the wrong way. And one time they was rubbing me the wrong way. Always drunk, getting in getting in um trouble and shit. Then going off on re- on reporters when they ask them questions and shit like that. So it's a hell of a way to promote yourself. The reporters are there for you to promote yourself. They not there for you to be beefing with them. Y'all they, they don't fight. I don't know why I go after the reporters and shit. Even though they even though they ask you questions that can get you jammed up and shit. Just don't answer that question. Say next. Keep keep them motherfuckers your friend. You can knock on everything, but the motherfuckers don't show up at your fights and don't 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 write about you and don't put you on the internet. You're not gonna um or put you out there, you're not gonna be that great. But I think Libra should just wait, man, or or try to move down to 47. Because Charlo's dangerous, man. Charlo's are very dangerous, man. And you look at them and say, Deontay Wilder, they they like Deontay. No, they're not like Deontay Wilder. Because they're, what makes them different from Deontay Wilder is what makes them probably more dangerous than Deontay Wilder is because they, they put both of them punch with both hands. They got better jabs and they got better they got better balance. They can throw a whole bunch of punches and stay on balance. Deontay Wilder can only throw one one punch. He don't even have a good left hook. He he throws the left hook sometimes but it's very few and far in between. He don't throw it enough. And I believe they more a more explosive than he is. No, that nigga can explode too. I don't know, but they are better. They 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 can box a little better than him, and and they can box going backwards too. That's that's another wrinkle in they they in they game. They can go backwards. That's how they beat. That's how that's how they beat. That's how they um Jamel beat. That's how he beat the um guy. That's how he beat the big banana by going backwards. Big Banana got real relaxed, chasing him around, and then as soon as he got comfortable, he shot shooting punches at him. Now he don't even see half the punches coming. That's why they knock you down. They they don't have to be placed right or nothing. If I was a Charlo, would I would I if I was them, I'll work on upper body movement. They were if they work if they start right now and they only like thirty one. 31 years old, if they start working on upper body movement, like person throwing punches at them, slip a few slip a few shots, then get some off, if they upper body movement was better, they will be dangerous. I'm talking about, I'm talking about crazy dangerous. If they worked on their legs more, moving around the ring better, and upper body movement. They'll be they'll be dangerous. That means they can make you miss and counter you. If they add that to their repertoire, they'll be dangerous, man. No doubt, they'll be super super dangerous. I don't I won't see nobody beating them if they add that one wrinkle to their game.